the latest look at the all diabetes team Novo Nordisk, we headed to their development team house in Atlanta. Hi, I'm Daniel Holt, director of Team Novo Nordisk Development. This is our house. Come on in and take a look. First thing you'll notice is there's six refrigerators here. We got upwards of 17 people living at the house at any one time. They need a lot of space to carry a lot of food. We got a lot of different languages being spoken here too. With all 17 guys and kind of a small house, it makes it a lot easier if you got a, a chore list. Looks like Medi's on garbage duty this week. We got laundry rules, we got trash rules, we got recycling rules. We got rules everywhere. The hope is that many people will start following rules and we don't have problems like this anymore. And this is our laundry room. Our guys are known for their white kits. This is the only thing that keeps them bright white. And here's another refrigerator. We call this the Devo House, the short for development. We're actually the feeder team for the Professional Continental Team Nova Nordisk. Here, some guys are developing some things right now. Ryan's developing his game skills. I think Hale does too. Zvon's doing something great. He's foam rolling right now, doing some myofascial release. We got Chris over here. These are uh, compression booties. They actually put a lot of tension and it cycles air through the chambers and it increases the circulation of the legs, bringing more fresh blood in and letting them recover faster. And we can get back out on the bike. Let's see who we got up here. Here's a guy sleeping now. Young camera. <laughs> Let's see where some of the other guys sleep. Chris, you're unpacking right now from a uh, Two week long trip? You were just on the road? Yeah. Racing? Two weeks out on the road in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and the North Star GP in Minnesota. And pretty much repacking for the Junior Talent Identification Camps in Athens tomorrow. <laughs> it's like the most organized I've seen someone's bag. Let's go downstairs and take a look at the bikes. Well, here we are at the shop. Mechanic works on a lot of wheels. We go through a lot of wheels. We get a lot of flat tires. We break a lot of wheels. This one here is made of carbon fiber. Tubulars, like always, standard racing tubular. I think this is just his uh, random pieces pile, just in case he needs something. Here's an aerodynamic disc wheel. We use it for time trials. I'm gonna throw a tubular around there. It's made of carbon fiber. It's very stiff and allows you to cut through the wind. Here we have the bike room. This is kind of where all the magic happens. Here everybody gets prepped for rides, does the fine tuning on their bikes. We got Fran right here, adjusting his seat height. He just got a brand new bike. He just flew from Alicante, Spain. He uh, came to the airport and they told him that his bike was too big to go on the airplane. So he didn't come with a bike. So now he's got a new bike. We just gave it to him. I hope he's gonna be careful with it. These are all one piece carbon fiber, Paul Fran's carbon fiber. As you can see, they try to put as much carbon fiber on everything on these bikes, including the rails of the seat post, you can see. It's even got an aerodynamic seat post. And a really short stem. Yeah. You can change that? So long. Yeah. <laughs> this is the main thing that anybody changes on a bike, if you want to get your fit just right. It's coming in right around 15 pounds. The ones you get from the store, probably going to weigh around 30. And, most importantly, it's way stronger. These are some of the stiffest bikes you can get. We got Chris over here, Justin is shifting right now. He's kind of our in-house mechanic. He races for the team, but he also works on all the bikes. We're just fiddling with the cable tension on the rear derailleur, making sure it's shifting up and down the cassette nice and smoothly. Well, that's it for the Team Novo Norris Development House. Hope to see you guys on the road soon.